Wow, wow. Look where we are again. Here in another new RPG Maker game. Well, new as in this was made this year. As in, this is version 1.2 as it says in the bottom left corner. As in, hello everyone! And welcome to another RPG Maker game! I don't know why, but it feels like it's been so long since I finished Feral Dreams. It probably has been. Because the time of this recording, I'm not really looking at the general time frame. I finished Feral Dreams, but we're here to play Journey to the East! Anyway, let me look at my notes real quick. I, I wrote down some stuff. This game was made by Nakaruru on the RPG Maker forums. And it's made on RPG Maker MV, which is new. I think I've only played one other MV game and I was running Geek Grounds. So, the thing about this game is... It's... It kind of works like Final Fantasy VIII in the sense that enemies scale with your level in terms of strength. And apparently you're supposed to get equipment that will help you get have a bit of an edge in combat against those enemies. And there's some other fun stuff. It's a 10 to 15 hour game. As always, I will leave a link to the thread in the description. And then not forget about it because that seems to be a running habit with me. But without further delay, let's get into it. I did have to lower like all the volume to like 20 so that way I can hear my voice whenever I edit. So, you know. Let's just get into it, why don't we? Okay, story select. I can only choose... I can only choose the one. So the thing is, I haven't really, you know, played any of the game yet. I literally tracked through the Karmic Destiny, like, opening part, and that was it. I didn't play anything. So, we're gonna start with Comic Destiny because it's a prologue, so let's do it. During the Age of the Apocalypse, when the sun and moon disappeared from the sky and ancient tribes of man destroyed each other, two opposing entities known as higher beings or gods fought over the dominion of all life on Eos? We're gonna call it Eos. The spiritual core of the entire universe, the birthplace of human beings. As one of their cruel and twisted plans, the gods manipulated two loving sisters, Lucerita and Ellis, and turned them against each other by destroying them, them each stones of power known as the Akasha Keystones. Ellis, child of mortals, the harbinger of chaos. Take the Black Akasha Keystone and destroy the servants of my arch eminence, Akon! The Supreme Being, the Lord of Light and Order! Your sister, Lucy. Lucerita. Words are hard! Is a traitor, and your enemy! Show her no mercy! The world will convert to one, the one true religion of chaos and worship Athos as the one true god. Non believers will burn in the hellfires of the underworld. Wow. That's kind of heavy. Oh, Lord of the Astral Plane, I beseech you. Please save my world from the cancerous power of chaos. Lucerita, I bestow upon you my knowledge and wisdom in this holy crystal, the white Akasha Keystone. Use it to vanquish my enemies, the servants of Apos, the master of chaos and darkness, the source of all evil. Build an empire that will stand as a beacon of hope for all humanity. <clears throat> Sorry. Spread my teachings to every corner of this good earth. And thus, an empire was founded on the day of the great goddess Akin Akin Ak Akinessa. There we go. It's birthday. Its name. The Akinasian Empire of the Holy Land. Also known as the Golden Cradle of the West. Huh. Year Zero, the first year of antiquity. Your Holiness. Your Holiness! The Council of Inid cannot begin without you, Your Holiness. Thank you, Senator. Okay, prologue, Karmic Destiny. So I guess I'm in control. Your Holiness, you must proceed to the Council Chamber. Okay. Let's go to the council chamber. 
the first empress of our new empire has arrived! All hail Lucerita, empress of Akinestia! Akinestia. The light of Eos! Please be seated, senators. We will now begin the council in need. We must decide how to deal with the heretics in the eastern lands. Talk to the senators, see what they have to say. There's a lot of dudes here. The chaos supremacists are weak. They are no threat to the Empire. Coward! Who said that? Wow. Your Holiness. I am still undecided, but I will make another decision soon. I say we dispatch all our armies east and burn the heretics. No! They're still good now, Alice! We could save her from the evil! Surely you jest! She is completely consumed by evil! Voting will begin soon. Decide how the nations will deal with the chaos supremacists. A to declare in war. Nay to make peace. Cast your vote in the ballot box. Oh boy. Blow them up in war or try to find a peaceful solution. Honestly, I don't think blowing them up with wall out war is probably the right decision. I think it will just make things worse. I think let's go with nay. Senators, we will now count the ballot. The council has decided. WAIT! Who the heck is this? There is one more vote. I am here on behalf of Princess Kia to cast her vote. Quickly, boy! We haven't got all day! Yes, sir. A's 29, nays 32. I guess he he picks for whatever side we go on. The nays have it. The nays have it! The counters decide to leave the heretics alone in the east. We will not go to war. History will later reveal that it was the wrong decision. Damn it! The chaos supremacists were left unchecked, which led to the birth of the chaos imperium. And thousands of years of war. Well, shit! Why did it bad? Many years later, Zenith the Tormentor, the Archpriest of the Chaos Imperium, invaded Akinestia. Kind of words are hard. To war! There will be no salvation for the infidels! Well, shit! Well, I did bad. Oh, mighty Minerva, goddess of the astral plane of chaos, offspring of Apos, grant me your infinite power so I can quash my enemies in the west. Chaos will reign supreme in Eos. You have done well to lead my armies, loyal servant of chaos. I will enter the realm of mortals and claim it as my own. Oh, boy. The ethereal goddess eat god eaters from the darkest corners of the astral plane will be unleashed. Nothing can stop the invasion, not even the bastard child goddess, Akinesia. Akinesia. It was a one-sided war, which destroyed half the world. Wow! This is wild! And we've just started the year 55, the last year of Lucerita's reign. Your Holiness, do you still want to do this? We're near the top of Mount Cellstar. I cannot turn back now, Pantu. Pantu. I must return the keys to the gods. The world is ruined. If only I did not accept it from them. Please do not blame yourself. The fault is mine. Fifty-five years ago, I should have voted in favor of intervention in the East. We would have destroyed them when they were weak. Stay safe, my liege. Yeah, I feel like I did bad. Okay, whoa, what is this? This is wild. I can't... I can't die. Okay, there we go. I can't dash. So where... Oh. Why are you here? Why are you here? Consider your answers carefully. What you say here will affect the rest of the- Oh my gosh. I am here to return the keystone. Why? I don't want my people to suffer. The keystone's power is dangerous. I want to rely on my own strength and not on others. Hard. I don't know what to choose. It's like all these answers feel like the right one, but I can only pick one. Uh, I don't want my people to suffer. 
and absolute power corrupt humanity? Yes, humans do not understand how to use it. No, as long as they learn. Yes. Do you believe that humanity is weak? No, I have faith in my own people. Yes, it's because it's God's will. I have faith in my own people. Is evil necessary in this world? In order for good to exist, no, it must be just. To be honest, I really do think. I'm gonna go with yes. Is God needed in order to create, maintain balance in the universe? I don't know. Who is this girl? Her identity is not important. What she will do is what matters. She does not exist at this point in time, nor will she exist in the future unless you sacrifice something that you value. But what would she do if she existed? She is the one who the universe yearns for. She is the one who will triumph over all possibilities. She may be our last hope. Now, the final question. How much are you willing to sacrifice to ensure her success as an existence in this universe? Give too little and she will suffer for all eternity. Think carefully. I will sacrifice my... Your health. I think this is the right choice. So be it. Because the most precious thing of all is your life. And now the story continues. 6,000 years later, in the quietest corner of the world. The little fishing town of Galeport, and the peaceful nation of the Prismornia Union. These names are hard! Okay, whoa. Galeport is a peaceful fishing town located in the northwestern part of the continent. Far from the military frontier bordering the hostile nations of the Chaos Imperium, it has seen no wars for a hundred years. Okay, holy sites, towns, and other. So I guess this is where we're going. Year 6056, day 4, month 4. Who's that? What if she remembers? She won't. I've sealed her memories. Cries. We must leave this place, milady. They're catching up to us. Be happy here, my child. What is this child doing here? There's a letter, but it's stained in blood. I plead with the person who's reading this. Please protect my daughter, Risa, with your life. Keep the family heirloom safe until my daughter has come of age. Do not show it to anyone. Her true identity must remain hidden at all costs. She has many enemies in the Eastern Lands. Oh, poor child. She misses her parents. All right, I'll raise her into a fine young woman. Someday you'll reunite with your parents. They'll be so proud of you. Well, I hope so. So this is Reese. Whoa, what the heck? What's this? Where the heck are we? Is this some kind of dream sequence flashbacky thing? Who am I? Why am I here? You're asking the wrong person there, girl. Where am I going? Where are we even at, though? Is the question. Like, I'm not moving at all. I'm... Eight years later. Whoa, okay. A dream. I was in a palace. That was a palace? It was like an endless hallway of snow and darkness and gray. Where was that place? Huh? What was that? Oh boy, bad stuff's already happening. Looks outside. 
Something strange is happening. I need to go outside and see what's going on. Okay. Start the journey east. Okay, we can check Reese's journal. So we have the main quest. And we have information. I'm just an ordinary teenage girl living in a small town, but... And... Okay. And then we have battle command, controls... We find first doing the dangerous journey capital. Okay. Okay. Save points in the game or store your HP and MP. Okay, that's useful. Journey across the war-torn country will be fraught with many dangers. The Prismani Union has been invaded by great power from across the sea and the invaders have marched towards the capital. Be wary at all times. Do not engage in unnecessary combat, as some adversaries there are stronger than others. Information is the key to survival. Pay attention to what people tell you. It may save your life. Okay. So do I have anything? All I have is the family heirloom. Do you have any skills? I have steel. I can learn skills, but I don't have anything I can learn. We have TP mode. Raise the TP by guarding in battle or receiving damage. TP by attacking and dealing HP damage. Oh! Okay! I see what that is. It's kind of like in Final Fantasy games. And we have... A brilliant Seraphan. And I don't have a cloak. I don't have a weapon. I don't have like, anything. Okay. Okay. Okay, this is interesting. Chaos is an element. Oh my gosh, are you serious? There's a charm status in this game. Okay. Title, Miss. Okay. Eight. She's only 14? Okay. Alignment, good. It's the front row. It's the back row. Books and allies here take less melee damage. Oh, we have a picture gallery. And music book. And then options and diary. Oh, it's the save mode. Okay. Alright, let's go outside. Can I check down here? <laughs> it looks like no one's home. I can loot this place. Hey, there's somebody here! I'll have to kill her first! Here I come. Okay, I have to fight this dude. What's... I can't even steal from him. A scrawny brat! <laughs> wow, that actually did damage to him. Yeah, I killed him! I got a Curia, an Aoife, and a Reviva, and Tangled. You bitch! And so, Risa's story begins. Chapter 1, Mousetrap. Well, I beat up that dude. Oh, well, this is Prismani Gold. So it's like, ain't it, you know? Here, the gold ring. Who is this woman? Peter Kong III, a famous writer in the 20th century, wrote a story called Journey to... Ah, the writing is illegible. 21st century? When was that? The Stone Age? Wow. Okay. So you get stuff by looking around, so we should probably, like... Can I not turn on the caps lock, please? We should probably, like, look around. Get that Curia. Get that other thing. Nothing else? Nothing else. Alright, let's go. I need a weapon to protect myself. I think I can find one in the basement. Well then, girl. Five curious. I need curious to heal myself when I'm injured. I should search around a bit more. I might find something else that's useful. Nothing found. Now I need to, like, check everything everywhere. Like a salmon? Okay, I'll take- Whoa, it's kind of dark down here. Money. Another salmon. Unlock that. Get another Curia. And a carrot. Okay. What else do we got around here? A safe. 
I don't know the combination, though. Got that sushi. Picture one has been unlocked in the gallery. There are 16 pictures in the game. Unlock them all to obtain a rare item. And I got a weapon. Equip the dagger by opening the menu and select equip. What's this, then? Oh, this is a safe spot. So let's equip that dagger. There we go, now we're talking. Let's check out that picture. Okay, so this is literally like... Wow, the Chaos Imperium has quite a large area over there! We're all the way over in the Prismani Union. Wow. We got ways to go. Alright then, let's get the heck out of here. So, can I find information on that safe combination? Up here, maybe? Oh, nothing. Alright. I guess the safe's not that important yet. So let's get out of here for now. Whoa. Please! Somebody! Help me! Ha! Pathetic! I will gut you like a pig! No! Ha ha ha! Let's see if she's got any gold. It's not safe here. I need to escape. Stay out of enemies' line of sight if you want to avoid fighting them. They will chase you until you're out of range. Okay, that's locked. That's locked, too. Okay, so as long as they don't see me... Got that ether. What's going on over there?! There's literally a bunch of dudes! Got some cork and ham. Okay, well, I'm not going that way, that's for sure. And I got another Curia. Alright, real quick, let's grab this. Another Curia. Crap! Can I use my... No, I can't. Okay, there we go! I'm doing a lot more damage now. Now can I use it? Alright. He's got... Rat me... Okay, so this is really just like a list of stuff I... He can... He has. And there's the chance of me stealing it. There we go, he's dead. But it seems like enemies also have this special gauge, so that they can use their stuff. Crap. Alright, I'm gonna have to kill you two then, dude. Wow, I 3 ko this dude now. Alright, yeah, give me all that. Give me all your money. Uh... Okay, I'm restores a lot more HP than I was thinking. All those soldiers! I'll be able to sneak past them if I keep my distance. Alright, whoa, wait. I wanna avoid that dude there. So I'm gonna have to probably fight you. Don't give up! And get out of here. Get fucked, guy. Well, I'm 40 XP off. Yeah, let's... There's another one?! Didn't I just fight a dude, like, not even a few seconds ago? Not like he matters, he's pretty weak. I got level. Oh, two! Cool. Alright, let's search around for stuff. Uh, hi there, old man. Hey, are you okay, mister? You are Alex's foster child, are you not? 
Yes, it's me, Risa. Look what we have here. A little mouse trying to escape. No, stay away. Die for our great leader. Jesus, just die. Okay, you're an easy dude. Easy kill. Aw, uh, hi. Stairs into his dark crystal. I have come from a country thousands of leagues from here. My crystal has detected great power in this town. Who are you? I sense you have that power. Oh crap. Give it to me now! Uh, this guy looks actually very intimidating. Let's heal first. That power is mine! Wait. Oh, that's a plot point. I was supposed to die there. I'm scripted. No, I can't die here. A warm aura envelops Risa's entire body. Risa's power is awakened. Wait, what? I got a class change to Esper. What is this light? So, do I get a full heal? Uh, unknown. Let's use it. I can feel it. Something is burning inside me. I can do this! What? Did I just do over 9,000 HP to him? Wow, that dude got fucked! You! You! That power! It can't be! I know what it is! He blew up! Risa absorbs the enemy's ability! Biokinesis! What happened just now? The burning inside me, it's disappearing! Are you alright, young lady? Listen, you have to escape! Head south towards the capital! Avoid enemy patrols along the way! You'll be safe there! Why are they attacking us? They are soldiers from the Emperor! The old man passes away. Power up! Alright, got Ether. Got some bread. Alright. So, we now have a skill, and I can use it up to ten times. Alright, let's go. Let's scour the place for more stuff, some bread, more money, some honey, and I think that's everything. Let's be on our way, then. Let's go south. Have you heard of the story of the goddess Ankinesa? Almost everyone in Eos has heard it. It forms the basis of Ankinesa Etha, the most widely practiced religion in the western sphere of the world. And it started after Lu Lucerita returned the keystone to the astral plane 6,000 years ago. The Wars of the Ancients. Okay, we're getting more lore. Apos. Why do you bring suffering to the human world? Disband your armies and never return! Aha! So the Great Mother Goddess has shown herself. Your end is near. Can you fear it, my dear Isis? The sun has grown cold on your face. Death is inevitable for you and your kin. As Eos was engulfed in flames, hearing the play of the human world, Isis, the Great Mother Goddess, sent her children to stop the war. Five celestial armies were sent through the Eternal Gate, a transdimensional corridor that connected Eos to the Astral World. Led by Akinesa, the heir apparent to the throne of a million stars of Heliopo Heliopolis, the seat of power that governed the Astral Plane. However, they are betrayed by their own armies as they defected to Minerva's cause. Cornered and outnumbered, Isis' children fought gallantly to the bitter end and fell in battle. Akinesa was slain by Minerva's infamous sword, the Inferna Magna. The astral world plunged into eternal darkness. Apos was victorious. <laughs> the heir to the throne is dead! Your bloodline is no more! 
Savor this moment of victory if you wish, but it will not last long. I shall have my vengeance in this life or the next. Saddened by the deaths of their children, Isis destroyed the Eternal Gate along with the armies of Chaos by using the Keystone. Relinquished, by her immortal, relinquished her immortal status to become a mere human in the process. Nobody knew what happened to her after Eos was saved. Some say that she died of her wounds. Others, that she found refuge on Eos and lived out her days as a mortal in solitude. As for the fate of the goddess Minerva, who disappeared after the battle, was the biggest mystery of Eos yet to be solved. So it's likely that she's alive. The legend of Akinessa, the tragic goddess, was one of the most popular stories among the people of Eos. They believed that one day, the great goddess would return to lead her people from the darkness, and finally ascend her rightful throne of the astral world. Excuse me, the astral world. So that's the beginning. Well then. That's kind of wild. Okay. Arcticella, the capital of Prisma Pony <laughs> Union, is southeast of here. I need to keep moving and avoid any contact with the enemy. Do not approach any enemy battalions on the world map. Wow, they're blowing that place up over there. Alright, well here we are, that place. I need to find a save. Alright, here we go. There's a town. Um, hi, guy. New in town, are you? You should visit my folks in the little house by the river. They will teach you how to survive in this harsh world. Wow, old man! Like, you see some young girl walking on in, that's the first thing you tell her? You really need to learn how to talk to the late. Wait, is it getting darker out? Oh, that's cool. Alright, let's find a save point because we're gonna end things off here! May the light of Sylvanity shine upon you, my child. Okay, is there a save point here? Greetings, child. This is the Church of Sylvanity. Please feel free to look, but don't touch! Alright, is there a save point here? Uh, this looks like a save. Alright, yeah, there's a save here. So, next time on Journey to the East, we're gonna. Wait, what is that? Happiness? Unhappy. Well, yeah! We just left the place where everyone died! Of course we're gonna be unhappy! But anyway, next time, we're gonna try and be less unhappy and do some fun stuff. I will see you then.